Welcome to St. Peter's School and thank you for taking the time to join us on this video tour. Life has never been so full of opportunities, but with challenge and change ever present, our aim here is to develop confident, rounded young men and women who make the most of their abilities in preparation for a successful, fulfilled life. Founded in 627 AD, St. Peter's is the fourth oldest school in the world and one of the country's leading schools. Our academic results are outstanding, but we believe that independent thinking and a love of learning are just as important as excellent grades. So here there is a real focus on developing intellectual curiosity in the classroom and beyond, with pupils and staff being members of a vibrant learning community. The achievement of academic potential is central, but an education based only on qualifications is limited and frankly, rather dull. School days should be full of fun, adventure, challenge and new experiences. So we offer a huge range of sporting, artistic and cultural opportunities because we want our pupils to establish interests that stay with them for life, as well as learn the skills that will make them stand out in a fast-changing world. There is something for everyone at St Peter's with high levels of participation, offering opportunity for the specialist as well as the all-rounder. Peterites are confident but also grounded and it's their enthusiasm that brings a spark and enjoyment to each day. All pupils are cared for as individuals and links between home and school are a source of pride which continues long after school days are over through the active alumni organisation, the Old Peterites. On this tour, you will see that our beautiful campus brings the calm which comes from a countryside setting while we are just a few minutes from the heart of York. Together, this gives a strong sense of being part of a modern dynamic community where we walk, as our motto says, over ancient ways and ensure that each generation is equipped with the keys for life. I hope to be able to welcome you in person very soon. Welcome to St Peter's 8 to 13. My name is Andy Falconer and I'm the head of the middle part of St Peter's School, where we look after 400 8 to 13 year olds in years 4 to 8. We are located on the lower part of the 47 acre campus in what used to be the Queen Anne School. We are also the choir school for York Minster. Our five year groups are called J1 to J5 and one of the things that makes us different from many schools in the area is that our J1 to 3s, so year 4 to 6 children, are taught by subject specialists for about two thirds of their week. This allows them access to specialist facilities and teaching from eight years old. Our eight learning habits underpin the skills that we are developing in the children. By helping the children develop these learning habits, we are equipping them with the skills that will help them both within and out with school, now and into their futures. The other area that is key to our education is encouraging the children to develop a growth mindset. Understanding that we can all get better at everything, no matter what level we currently are at. We don't say, I can't do this, we say, I can't do this yet. In the Shepherd Hall, every class has a weekly drama lesson. And we also offer Lambda classes as part of our co-curricular programme. We have termly music concerts in the evening, where our ensembles have a chance to perform in front of family and friends. I also take a weekly Heads Assembly here on Friday mornings. We are so fortunate to have a wonderful library space with over 10,000 books and overseen by a full-time librarian. Each class spends one lesson a week in the library and they can also come in at break and lunch times if they just want to curl up with a book. Having specialist science teachers and two well-equipped science labs means the children can take part in a wide variety of experiments. Our life skills program includes things such as learning to cook, how to save a life using CPR, bushcraft skills and team building. There are also after school cookery clubs which are always very popular. Computing isn't just about learning how to use software applications, although we do make sure the children are confident in their use of the standard office software. It's also about creating and solving problems, and so half of our IT curriculum is devoted to coding and programming. There aren't many eight-year-olds who have access to a design technology workshop like this. Every child has a double design technology lesson each week, as well as their double art lesson, as we believe that nurturing creativity is so important. This is one of our two art studios, where the children have the chance to develop skills in drawing, painting, working with fabric and textiles, as well as ceramics. 
Having dedicated spaces outside of the classroom really helps the children to develop their artistic creativity. The music life of the school is something you can hear everywhere, with lessons taking place in dedicated music rooms such as our new music pods. We have over 250 individual music lessons taking place each week, with a huge variety of instruments including the oboe, French horn, drums, the harp, piano, violin and flute. We have weekly lunchtime concerts. Each term there's a big evening concert which gives our larger ensembles a chance to perform. We are the choir school to York Minster, which means that the Minster choristers are all here at school and have their morning rehearsals before singing an evensong later in the day. Our games programme includes rugby, hockey, cricket and tennis for the boys, and hockey, netball, tennis, rounders and cricket for the girls. We travel all over the North East to play in competitive fixtures against other schools. There is also the opportunity to go on a UK-based sports tour in J2 and an overseas one in J5 along with our annual ski trip, usually to Italy. In our P lessons, the children will cover activities such as swimming, volleyball, gymnastics, dance, badminton and football. We are so fortunate to have our own 25 metre pool here on campus, allowing us to teach all our children to be confident swimmers. Our house system is central to our pastoral care. All staff and teachers are allocated to one of our five houses. It allows the children to get to know and recognise children in different year groups, making the school seem much smaller. Each teacher looks after a group of 14 children, some from every year group, and will be their mentor for however long that child is in the school. School lunches are homemade by our in-house catering team. There is always a choice of hot options, a hot dessert, as well as soup, sandwiches, salad bar and yoghurt and fresh fruit. The teachers sit and eat lunch with their house so they get to know the children better. Thank you for looking around St Peter's 8-13 to 13 with me, even though it has been a virtual experience. The one thing you probably won't pick up on through this medium is the vibrancy and sense of fun and energy that the children have, and the way they enjoy their learning and support each other in it. I hope to be able to welcome you to our school in the near future, so you can experience this unique learning environment for yourself.